Hey, this is Andrew from Small Green Computer, and I'm going to show you how to get Rune set up on a dedicated server. Uh, today we're using the uh, Sonic Transporter i5, uh, but this would certainly work with um, some other things like an NEC running rock or something like that. Um, so here you can see on the back, we've got a couple different connectors. It's basically just a network connection. Uh, if possible, you want to use a direct Ethernet connection right to your, to your router. Um, you can use some sort of intermediary things. Try not to use a Wi-Fi gateway or something. That's going to reduce your quality. And then uh, plug in, plug in the power, um, and then uh, turn it on. Uh, that's pretty much it. This is a, this is a plug-and-play appliance. So we're going to do all the configuration from the Rune app. Download the Rune app on your computer. You can use this to configure the Sonic transporter. Uh, just go to runelabs.com, more downloads, and then download the uh, the one that matches your computer. You can see they've got Windows versions and also a Mac version. You can see this is a control, and also the core will be running in, in control mode. I've downloaded and installed Rune and put it on my computer, started it up, and here's what it you know asked me for a license agreement. And then see, it's asking me if I want to create a, a local core or remote control. We want to do remote control because we're using this to configure this Sonic Transporter. So here's my Sonic Transporter here. Connect to that. Enter my uh, Rune license. I have to unauthorize my Mac, and then we're ready to go. So here we just add the default folder, and again, this is the music folder on the Sonic Transporter. And then if we have a title account, we can add it. It's very easy to add later, so I'm just not going to add my title now. And here we are. I've already added some uh, music to my uh, Sonic Transporter. I have another video that shows you how to get the music from your computer onto your Sonic Transporter. Uh, so the next step is to add some audio devices so we can uh, we can play our music. So here we can see I have an ultra rendu on here. It just needs to be enabled to work with this room server. Enable it. I'm just going to call it ultra. And that's done. Now I select an audio zone to play. Select my audio zone. And then I go over here and pick a Dell here and start playing. There's a that's it. fire starting in my heart. Uh, Reaching the fever pitches bringing me out the dark. Find a 